So now that you got your air tags, you got them all into your loops, you got them into your bands and all that different stuff like that. You've been using them now and you're starting to notice that the battery level on your air tags is starting to go down. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how easy it is to replace the battery of the air tags with a CR32 battery, which is the battery that it takes. So without further ado, let's get right to it. All right. So now that we got our air tag, now the first thing that I personally recommend that you guys do, if you guys haven't watched it yet, I did a video on how to actually remove your air tag from your iOS device. So first thing you guys are gonna wanna do is you wanna go to your Find My app and then you're gonna notice the AirTag that you guys want to replace. Now, one thing that you guys can do with this is if you go ahead and scroll up to the top, you guys will have the option to be able to see the battery level. Now, obviously this being a newer one, the battery hasn't drained, but you will be able to see the battery level's power right here in the top of the Find My app for each individual AirTag that you guys have. So you wanna make sure you guys are checking that and keep an eye on that. As the battery level decrease, you will get a notification on your device letting you guys know that your AirTag it's starting to get low and you might want to go ahead and replace that battery so first thing i recommend you guys do is remove the item now i did a whole video showing you guys how to go through the proper process of removing an air tag from your device so i recommend doing that now you don't have to remove the air tag it will still remember it your device even when you swap out the battery i just like doing it because to me it's like it's better to go ahead and reset it if i'm putting in a new battery and kind of set it up as a fresh new item so first thing you guys want to do is just take the bottom of it you want to hold it pretty firm and then you want to go ahead and just do a slight twist to the left and then it's just going to pop off the back like you see right here now it gives you the plus and minus so on the top you want the plus to be facing upward so we're going to go ahead and sit that one down here to the side and we're just going to pop out this battery like you see right here take another CR32. Now the ones I recommend are by Energizer. I'll go ahead and link them down in the description section below. I've been using these for a couple of years now. They've worked well. So you just want to go ahead and take that, take the new battery, make sure the plus icon is pointing upward. And then you just want to kind of sit it right in here. You're going to hear that sign go off that lets you know that the battery is in there, right? And then you want to go ahead and take the top, put it right back on top, align it with the groove holes. So you see the holes that we have right here. So there's three holes on each side and you just want to go ahead and align one of those to it. And then you just press down firmly and you're just going to take your thumb and you're going to twist it into place. And just like that, you have just replaced the battery of your AirTag. And just to make sure it is working we're going to go ahead and pair it back to our phone so all i gotta do is just keep your phone nearby and it's going to pop up the air tag here we're going to go ahead and press connect and let's just say we're going to put it to our bike and we're going to go ahead and press ok and just like that we're going to go ahead and allow it to do its thing and just like that we're all set up and ready to go if i use the find feature it's going to go ahead and connect it if i put it off to the screen here it's going to let me know that it's here it sees it and so forth i can play the chime from it works there you guys have it if you guys have any questions on how to replace the battery any uh questions that you have on the apple air tags definitely let me know down in the comment section below thanks again for watching and i'll see y'all in the next one squat <laughs>